In this TA Tech Tip, we're going to show you how to change the hang down wire on the Q500 and Q50 TGA. Having a straight hang down wire is important for getting the best from our data. So, to replace the hang down wire, we need to make sure our furnace is in the low position so we can get access to the base of the hang down wire, and we need to remove the balance housing cover. That's held on by the six screws on the front of the cover. These are captive to the cover, so they won't fall out for us, but we need to make sure that when we're at the sixth screw, we're holding onto the cover so it doesn't drop off. Once inside, we need to remove the cover from the sample side of the balance. And that's just held on by the thumb screw. The hang down wire is coupled to the balance mechanism using a capped on loop, which is quite small and can be hard to see. So if we put a piece of white paper behind it, we can see it more easily when we're trying to change the hang down wire. So to remove the old wire, we're going to use the sample changing tube. We're going to feed that up the thermocouple tube with the hang down wire inside it as far as it'll go. Now we can actually get access to the, to the old hang down wire and remove it from the coupling loop. So now we've got it free from the coupling loop. We can lower our changing tube and take the old hang down wire out. Putting the new hang down wire in is basically the reverse of the process. So we have our new hang down wire. One, part of the, one side of the hang down wire has a single loop to it and that's for our pan. The other side has a double loop. That's the bit we're going to hang to the top of our balance. So we can feed that into our loading tube so that our double loop is free. And when we're loading this, you want to make sure that the double loop is pointing to the left of our balance. That way, the sample's coupling loop will be pointing in the right direction. So again, we feed this carefully into the furnace and then up the thermocouple tube. Now at the top, we can bring our Capton coupling loop into contact with our top, the top of our hang down wire and feed it through the small hole which is in the Capton. This can be a bit fiddly, so just take your time doing it. Now we've got it in, we can lower our loading tube, making sure that as we get into the bottom, we don't bend the new hang down wire. So our new hang down wire is installed. We can remove the paper, we can put the balance cover. back on and we can put the balance housing cover back on. When we replace these screws we want to make sure that they're nipped up so we get a good seal on the balance housing. Now our hang down wire has been replaced we need to make sure that our hang down wire is well aligned with our furnace and the way we do that is to load a pan up. Once the pan is loaded, we can stop the furnace so that it's level with the pan and we can see how well aligned it is. We make sure that it's central in the hole for the furnace and so we know it's going to be central within the main furnace itself. Once this has been done and we've got the TGA aligned, we can recalibrate for weight and we're ready to run our samples.